Christy Angelo and welcome to my channel freelancing tips for beginners in this channel I will share some basic freelancing tips work from home online jobs my personal blog and I am doing also live strip every day 7 30 a.m. to 10 30 a.m. Philippines time and I am inviting you all to join in my live stream. So if you are new here, consider hitting that subscribe button below and the bell notification so that you don't miss my new videos. And in this video, I am going to guide you through a job interview, which is quite tricky. Where do you see yourself in five years from now so i will briefly explain how to come up with an ideal for your response or give you some clear tips without further ado let's get started why this question is tricky because the ultimate goal of any good hiring manager is not looking for just anyone but for the perfect or ideal candidates this question will easily filter out the ones who are not meant for this role keep in mind that you don't just answer the question you do in a way that your answer is in line with the company goals and values you already shown your interest for the position by applying and being now interviewed for it this question is meant to find out just how much you really desire the position so here is the simple quick tips how to answer this question Tip number one, be enthusiastic because no employer wants to hire someone, invest time and money into them if they are planning to leave soon. The hiring manager is looking for a professional who is genuinely enthusiastic about the position. Generic but realistic with replies. Keep your answer tailored to the position and be realistic as you can because job interviews are all about specific and real-life examples. Tip number two, be informed about the rule. Look at the rule and think how you might grow develop with it. It is, it is a big plus to study the department you are applying for. It's a structure and visual career moves for those who work there. If you can find this information, then this would be an excellent question to ask during the interview. And the last one, tip number three, divide your answer into two parts to simplify. The first part should focus on how excited you are about the current position and the second part is about your future plans and long-term projection within the company so i hope this sim these three simple tips can help you answer where do you see yourself in five years and if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up subscribe and share it with your friends thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in my next video thank you